my gears. Hey everybody, Eric Emmon Twins Twenty here. Quick channel update. Uh, some difficulties have come to the channel. Uh, there's a couple series on the channel that are going to have to go on hiatus because somebody, talking to you, broke something of mine and it makes a couple of the games I play a little more easier to do. Um, the Let's Play for GTA 4 and the eventual um, games... Um, Battle Gate 20 and Lost and Dam. Uh, I'm going to have to put that on hiatus even further than what I've been doing because the I play those on my laptop, which I'm doing everything on here right now. I play that on my laptop so I can record GTA 4 and get better sound and it just it works pretty good on the laptop. Um, uh, that game I use I bought years ago I bought a controller like looks like my PlayStation 1 but it has a wire on it and I did that uh, ex just for this reason to play games on my laptop that I'm not a, I'm not a keyboard CAD player I, I'm very bad at that certain games I have to use a controller like GTA games and American Truck Simulator is another one. I don't have a wheel for that. And I found using a controller works easier than using the keyboards. My controller has been stored in my desk drawer along with other electronic stuff for God knows how long. Even before I had that guy back in 2018. Well, he started playing with it the other day, and I tried stopping him numerous times, and then the one time I was away in another room, and the girls were supposed to be watching him, and they weren't watching, he finally destroyed the controller so bad the wire was ripped apart out of it, and two of the buttons, the bumper buttons. I'll show you on this one. This is the PlayStation one. Put the mic down. So, he had, there was a wire up at top there was a wire at the top here that was connected that you could plug in a USB cable into the computer. He broke that apart from this and then these two bumpers, two of these four bumpers he broke and there was nothing there. So, And he's been known to pulling the, the, the pads off these. He's pulled the ones off this one, my other PS4 controller, and now one of my PS3 controllers and destroyed my, my uh, controller on my laptop. So, because of that, I don't have the money right now to buy a new one, which would have to be through Amazon. Um, GTA 4 series is on hiatus, as well as Truck Simulator. I think I can still play the other games. I don't think I use the controller for those. So, like House Flipper, even though I haven't done a House Flipper video in a while. Uh, DDS, I can do that on here, which I still need to progress on my own off-camera. Uh, so those games won't go anywhere if I resume those. I just got to keep working on the PlayStation, which thankfully he hasn't destroyed those. I have three of these, and I can still play that. I need to order a new one or two of those soon. Because one of these, which I don't know which one is the good one and which one's, excuse me, the good one and which one's the bad one, because he's ripped all these off. I think this is the one with the good button here. I think yeah this one's the one with the good the button to re hit record so this is the one with a bad trigger or stick and then the other one's the good one with the bad button here so I don't know and I got Sierra's own controller which I don't like using because it, it just feels it's a it's a knockoff brand but anyways uh, any of the games on PS4 are gonna be okay as you've seen earlier today uh, October 3rd, 2022, I did another um, Vice City uh, video, which I'm going to try and keep pumping out more of those. We're going to keep doing the Maddens, and I'm thinking about bringing in a new series. I'm actually am going to bring in a new series, but I'm not going to say what it is. It's going to be a surprise, but keep a watch for the trailer. I'm going to do a... I'm going to do an announcement on a trailer for the next game series that's going to be coming to the channel. And I can hear some of you saying... I, what about some of the other series you put on hiatus? You're going to start a new one, but not those? 
I'm kind of in the mood to do this series. I've been wanting to do this since it came out. And so games like L.A. Noir that I started after one and I stopped after one episode. I still want to play L.A. Noir, but I think I need to play that on my own off camera to get a feel of it because trying to get a feel for a game and play do videos is tedious works. I kind of want to keep L.A. Noir aside, play it on my own just to get a feel for it better and then start over. So we'll probably, once I get that feel, the feel for that, I'll go back into it right away. And I'll continue that series. But this game series, when you see the announcement when I do it, you'll understand it. Why I'm doing it. I'm a big fan of this game series. This last one they made, which was a year or two ago. I can't remember the exact date offhand. It was a good game. And they're already working on the, they're either working on it or it's been, they just finished it, the sequel to it, and it looks really good, so keep watching. I'm going to be making a trailer for that soon. I'm just getting all sorts of gameplay footage and sounds together to make the announcement. Um, I'm thinking, I'm thinking about doing a revised Twins franchise. I know I said I was going to wait until Matt, or MLB The Show 22, never bought it. And I was going to when the Twins were doing good in real life this year. And then when they when they um, screwed up. Hold on, sorry. When they um, started stinking up the joint, I lost interest in them. But now I kind of want to go and do a series like I did last year in 2021 because I'm pissed off enough, I want to ride a ship and do it what I think the, the way the team should be running. So think about doing another Twins franchise in MLB 21, but with 2022 rosters. And doing things the way I think the Twins should be doing because I'm just, I'm confused right now. That's a possibility. I'm not for certain gonna add it, but we'll see. I want to get through Madden 23, 23 for the Vikings and then um, Vice City because once I get Vice City done I think then we're going to go to San Andreas and I was playing that off camera but for some reason one of the missions in San Fierro is not coming up and I think I know why and it's because I've been using cheat codes and I think there's a glitch in that somewhere about cheat codes so the uh the option to buy the car showroom across the street from where your garage is in San Fierro hasn't come up and I'm way past that point. So I think the game's glitched, so I think I'm going to start over on that. And I think when I do Vice City ends, that's what... So thanks to him, say hi Jonathan, just wave. Give me five. Give me a fist bump. Lay me some skin. <laughs> so because of him... GTA 4 is going to have to go on hiatus for a little bit, but it's not like I was doing anything with it right now. It's fine. Butthead. I mean, that controller is more than four years old, but the fact that it got broken and didn't have to be, it's disappointing. But that's okay, because now it'll get me to buy one that I like, a newer one. And as far as truck simulator, I want to get back into that. I'd love to get a setup with a wheel so I can do it that way and try it out because if the wheel's successful then I can implement it onto either that the PlayStation 4 or this for Wreckfest and use it that way but just letting you guys know uh, some of the gaming game game features on here are going to be hiatus for a little bit and what's to come so that's all for now until next time peace out